what is up everyone this is Gosu here from Serene Art. so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to design a simple open trials football poster right here in Pizzle Lab. so without further ado let's jump into it good so the first thing that we have to do is to delay this test over here and let me state this thing clearly right in this tutorial I'm going to design a poster in a way such that I'll start with a test and after that we'll come and work on a background later right so first of let me change the background color to black okay so let me pick black over here like I said we work we work on a background later on in a tutorial good so the first thing that I'm going to enter right now is probably enter the test open right and for this particular one I'm going to use one font which is go bold bold right so i'll make it capitalize tap on ok and move down to my fonts and i'll pick go bold right so if you don't have access to my font i recently updated my font and i've posted a video on that so check it out right away okay so i'm just going to increase the size of the text a little bit okay i think once it is okay and I'll bring it down to the middle over here by using the relative position tool and position it like this. After this, I'm going to make a copy of it. I'll edit this copy to trials, right? I'll make it capitalize and bring it down. Now I have to reduce the size of this particular one, right? So that it will fit perfectly under this one good I think it's okay now after this I can go ahead and bring in my first you know resource so I'll be using basically three elements in this design right so let me tap on a plus sign over here go to from gallery I got some football image and some footballer kicking football from the internet and I'm going to leave the link in the description to download all these resources so I got it right here and I just have to place it over here. Okay, I think this position is okay. So I'm considering the position of the ball and the player as well. So I think this is a perfect position. I have to place this, right? So I'm just going to log this layer right away. After this, I'll make a copy of the test, which is trial. After making a copy of it, I'll go to color and add a plain color to it just like this so that uh, it will not be showing over here, okay? The test will not be showing again because we literally want to add stroke 3. But if you are new over here and you don't know how this scene was done, simply tap on a plus sign over here and first of all, you see the slider over here. Just move it all the way down to transparency like this and you'll be good to go, right? So after that, tap on a check mark and scroll down to stroke you're going to add a stroke of one width size to it and the color for the stroke is going to be white after that we can just bring it down like this wow seems i just deleted my test so i have to go back to the stroke and add a stroke again okay so let me do that quickly Thing. let me use the position tool to bring it to the middle and see where it is hiding okay so I've seen it and let me push it down I think this should be okay but let's see what we can do right here okay this this is perfect good so let me lock the layers right now Okay, so now we can work on other things in this tutorial. So I want to enter a test like, let's say the name of the academy or the football organization uh, doing this currently. So I'll enter the name like Serene Football Academy. So for this test, I'm going to use Go Bold. Nope, I'm going to use, let's say Montserrat Semi Bold or Bold. Yeah, any of them. Alright, so okay, I'll pick the Montserrat board over here and I'll reduce the size of it to let's say 16 thereabouts. Okay, so I have to position it at the middle like this. Let me send it to the top a little bit. 
okay i think this is okay now and after this i'll just make a copy of this test and i'll edit it to something like uh let's say the the aim of the game or what whatever they are coming to do at the trial so uh i'll type something like play to show thyself or yourself approved okay play to show yourself okay so probably this this element or this test you'll be provided already so you can just copy and paste and go ahead right but in my tutorial i'm just going to say something like play to show yourself approved okay so i'll put it down here like this i think this is a perfect place to do that right and after this i'll make a copy of this open test right i'll select it make a duplicate tap on edit and what i'm going to do right now is to write the dates so let's say from 12 to 16th year let's say something like 16th uh, january 2022 right so i'm just going to short everything like this and i have to reduce the size okay So I think this is not bad. I have to use the relative position tool to position it nicely at the bottom. And after this, I'll just input a shape, a white shape preferably. Okay, after reducing the size of it, I'll tap on a check mark and send it to the bottom right here. Okay, I have to position it at the middle perfectly. And after that, I'll position it I'll use the position tool to move it up just a little bit because I'll enter a test on it like the venue of the of the event so I'll make a duplicate of this go to edit and I'll write venue so the venue um, I'm just going to say serene sports stadium assuming there is a sports stadium like that okay I'm just putting an imaginary name over there probably you will have access to the name that you want to use so this is what i'm going to use and i'm going to change the color to black so let me use the position tool and bring it down like this so i'll use the relative position tool to position it at the middle like this i think this is okay now now after this we have to now work on our background so now let's start with the background so we are going to import some two other resources so first one is a football right so let me pick it up quickly right here i'll bring it here send it to the back and reduce the opacity of it to let's say 33 thereabouts okay i think that is okay and i'm going to lock the layer after that i also have another resource that i have to bring in but before i bring that resource in i have to change the background color since this is not going to be the color we will use let me change the color quickly right so we are going to use this type of blue black background for this tutorial and from here we can go ahead and import our other image which is like a football pitch right i saw this on the internet and decided to download it and use in this tutorial so i'll bring it down like this and i'll go ahead and use the eraser tool to erase the top portion of it okay so i'm going to increase the size and probably reduce the hardness a little bit then i'll clear the top and i'll tap on the check mark after this i'll send it to the back like this and i'll reduce the opacity to let's say 30. okay so this is what i'm going to do so since it, it is at a background already let me position it well just like this okay so i can now go ahead and lock this layer as well so that we see how the whole flyer is going to look so this is basically how to design a simple 
opening trials, football poster, and pencil up. And I hope you do enjoy this tutorial. And if you want access to all my fonts, then probably check out the video on your screen right now. And I'm going to see you in my next video. Bless up. Thank you.